If the angles are in the ratio 1 is to 5 is to 6, find the ratio of its sides. So given that the angles are in the ratio of 1 is to 5 is to 6, so we can write it as A by 1 is equals to B, B by 5 is equals to C by 6. So comparing this, <coughs> converting this B and C in terms of A, we can write B is equals to 5 times of A and C is equals to 6 times of A. So since we know that the sum of angles in a triangle is 180 degrees, we can write A plus B plus C is equals to 180 degrees. Now substituting the value of B in terms of A which is 5A and C as 6A, we can write A plus 5A plus 6A is equals to 180 degrees. So that will be 12A is equals to 180 degrees. Transposing this 12 on the right hand side, 180 degrees divided by 12 is equals to 15 degrees. So now we have A is equals to 15 degrees. So B will be 5 times of A. So 5 times of A is 75 degrees and 6 times of A, C is 6 times of A. 6 times of 15 degrees is 90 degrees. Now we need to find the ratio of its sides. So we know that A is equals to A is to B is to C is equals to sin A is to sin B is to sin C. So <coughs> Sin, sin 15 degrees is to sin 75 degrees plus is to sin 90 degrees. So we know that sin 90 degrees is equals to 1 and we have to find the value of sin 15 degrees and sin 75 degrees and substitute in this one. So first we will find the value of sin 15 degrees. So 15 degrees can be written as 45 minus 30 degrees. So this is in the form of sin of A minus B. Expanding this, this will be sin A cos B minus cos A sin b. So in, in place of a we will substitute 45 degrees and in place of b we will write 30 degrees. So that will be sin 15 degrees is equals to sin 45 degrees into cos 30 degrees minus cos 45 degrees into sin 30 degrees. Now sin 45 is 1 by root 2 and cos 30 degrees is root 3 by 2. Cos 45 is 1 by 2 and sin 30 is 1 by <coughs> sorry sin 30 is 1 by 2 and cos 45 is 1 by root 2. Since the denominator is same, we can write it as root 3 minus 1 by 2 root 2. Therefore, sin 15 degrees is equal to 2 root 2. Now, we will find the value of sin 75 degrees. Sin 75 degrees can be written as sin of 45 plus 30 degrees. This is in the form of sin of A plus B. Expanding this in the form of sin of A plus B, which is sin A cos B plus cos A sin B. So, in place of A, we have 45 degrees and B 30 degrees substituting here. So that will be sin 45 into cos 30 degrees plus cos 45 into sin 30 degrees. <coughs> now sin 45 is 1 by root 2 and cos 30 degrees is root 3 by 2 and cos 45 degrees is 1 by 2, 1 by root 2, sin 30 degrees is 1 by 2. Since the denominator is same which is 2 root 2, we can add the numerators that is root 3 plus 1 by 2 root 2. Therefore sin 75 degrees is equal to root 3 plus 1 by 2 root 2. Now substituting here, so in place of sin 15 we can write root 3 minus 1 by 2 root 2 and sin 75 degrees is root 3 plus 1 by 2 root 2 and sin 90 degrees is 1. So since these two <coughs> have denominator 2 root 2, we will multiply and divide by 2 root 2 for this ratio which is 1. So we will get and all the denominators will get cancelled. So we will have root 3 minus 1 is to root 3 plus 1 is to 2 root 2. Therefore, the ratio of the sides is root 3 minus 1 is to root 3 plus 1 is to 2 root 2.